Rosemount Agriculture in the north of Tasmania is set on hundreds of hectares of lush green grass. Pristine dairy country and farmer James Greenacre is committed to keeping it that way. I have a strong connection to the dairy industry and keen to see it progress into the future. Driven by a passion for sustainable farming, animal well-being and producing high-quality milk, this property is managed by forward-thinking farmers. And I guess for us, you know, the things that we're doing well, we can do better. So having a continuous improvement mentality to what we do and trying to get better and better at, at every day at what we do. James is one of many farmers who have partnered with leading dairy company Fonterra Australia, home to some of Australia's most loved dairy brands, including Western Star, Bega, Perfect Italiano and Mainland and Duck River in Tasmania. As part of its commitment to sustainability, Fonterra has set targets across its supply chain, including an aspiration to be net zero globally by 2050, zero solid waste to landfill by 2025 and 100% reusable, recyclable or compostable packaging by 2025. And it all starts on farm. Consumers are increasingly want insurances around how they're food is produced, where it's produced, and it's produced in a manner that's safe and sustainable. So we see a real opportunity to bring those two things together. James and Fonterra's farm source paddock specialist Richard Bronsley regularly work together to lay out a path for continual improvement to address environmental priorities. This is done by analysing aspects such as the property's terrain, waterways and effluent and nitrogen management guided by a tailored, specialised farm environment plan. And that's given us a really great insight into our footprint uh, on the land and uh, with the cows and so giving us that baseline gives us a view of where we are right now and what we need to do to you know, improve on where we are. And what we try to understand is those areas that they're very innovative in, we can learn from, we can share those stories with our customers and then areas that they might not have as strong as focused and where we can help them with. The farm environment plan is paying dividends in different areas, including showing that the Rosemount farm is efficient in its emissions and can reduce its nitrogen use without impacting production. It gives us access to a serious amount of expertise to allow us to um, improve on what we do in relation to becoming more efficient. Which gives farmers an opportunity to set goals, showcase the great performance they already provide and also set the targets for what they do in the future. It's a really exciting program for us. This site here at Cressy is one of dozens of farms currently partnered with Fonterra to improve environmental outcomes, all working hard to maintain standards set by the industry and consumer. An hour down the road is another Fonterra farm committed to sustainable farming. It's trialling Asparagopsis seaweed as a natural supplement feed for dairy cows to reduce methane emissions. CSIRO research has found just small amounts of this seaweed can reduce emissions by more than 80%. Results so far means Fonterra and partner Seaforest are ready to take it to the next phase, which involves expanding to include more farms. And what's great for Fonterra farmers, they will have access in dairy to the asparagopsis solution if the trial proves successful. Our role is around understanding how we might be able to do that at scale, it's food safety. Um, the practicalities of feeding that. Fonterra believes there will be no single solution to the methane challenge with asparagopsis seaweed, just one of a number of solutions it is exploring. Caring for the environment for future generations is a collective responsibility. By bringing sustainability to the heart of everything they do, Fonterra and its farmers are driven across the board by passion, dedication and the knowledge that the dairy they produce is the best it can be for consumers and our environment. The more you can care for the land and the animals themselves, the more they give back. Um, and so part of that is, you know, farming just not only for today, but for tomorrow and, and well into the future.